Welcome everybody. Today I'm going to be showing you how to add a product from Shane directly inside your actual website. Stick around because we're going to be showing you how to do this really, really fast. So guys, first of all, what you want to do is to have two tabs to open where you have your Shopify and where you have Shane. So guys, if you don't have an actual website from Shopify, I'm going to leave you the link down below in the description so we can all get started totally free. Now that we have signed into Shopify, we are now here into our dashboard. So what I wanted to do is to import the products that we want from chain directly into Shopify, right? So first of all, what I wanted to do now that we are inside Shopify is to go back into chain. And here, what you want to do is to look how for the product that you do want to add directly inside your store. Let's say our case, for example, since we're focusing inside uh, decals, the bedroom decals and all that, we wanted to choose uh, this kind of uh, pillow case so we can add this cover directly into our store. So once you find the product you wanted to add, just leave this as it is. Let's go back into Shopify and let's go here into applications. Now here, what you wanted to do is to type search. And if you typed the applications you wanted to get started by importing the product, for example, Shane, it's going to be showing you a lot of drop shipping application that you can get started with. Now, in this case, what you wanted to do is to get started with an actual free plan. There's lots of them. If I click, for example, into Importify, I'm going to hit into install. What you want to do is to try to find an application that actually does some dropshipping and import that dropshipping directly inside your store. Let's get into install. As you should see here, we have a one day free trial. Additional is going to be uh, focusing into 14, 19 per month and make the import correctly. Now, I'm going to be showing you guys another solution just in case you don't want to pay for the actual subscription. So let's say, for example, that I wanted to add this product, right? So I'm going to hit once again into the name, the actual element of the product that I wanted to add. What I wanted to do is to save the image of the product that I wanted to import from Shane directly into my store. Now what I wanted to do is to open a new tab and look out for google.com. Now here, what I wanted to do is to go directly here and to search by image. And here I'm going to go for upload image. I paste my image. And as you should see, the same product has been selling into eBay, Amazon, Temu, uh, Shane, and so much more, even into Etsy. What does that mean? That means that Shane is part of something called drop shipping. Now, drop shipping is an actual great element. It's the actual tool where you can sell stuff that are not uh, directly created by you, but you can sell it from another drop shipping supplier. So that means that what I can do is to go back into my Shopify and instead of doing dropshipping with Importify or any other kind of application that tells me to add an actual subscription is to do this with something which is totally for free. I'm going to go here and tap drop shipping. Now, it should be showing you a lot of applications that can be helping you, of course, to do some drop shipping, can be helping you to do drop shipping totally for free. For example, there's CJ drop shipping, there's Jesus, there's Spocket, there's AutoDS, and so much more. Let's type, let's start, of course, with the CJ drop shipping. This is totally for free. There are a few charges, of course, with different plans, but since we wanted to do this totally for free, let's go into our main application. So to connect the actual importing of the products, what I wanted to do is to go here and to drag the uploaded image. I do exactly the same thing that I just did inside google.com, which is importing the image of my product and see if this product can be, is of course, imported here. So as you should see here, we have a lot of products that are related into what I'm actually looking for. I'm gonna click into this uh, product and as you should see, we do have different colors, but it seems like this product has been sold with different uh, course uh, colors. And if I go back here inside Shane, I might notice that this exact element, this is exactly the same. It's everything that we actually were looking for. That's the reason why we don't want to do a scam. What you wanted to do is try to find the product that everybody is selling. And if all of these media are selling exactly the same product, well, why can't you, right? So let's go back here into CJ Dropshipping. Let's go directly inside list. Now, if I hit into list, it's going to be asking us where's the store where you want to add a product inside product type. Let's go here. Um, I'm going to just leave this like this. Into collections, I'm going to go, of course, with pillowcases. 
and the vendor should be ourselves. All of this information should be provided by Shopify, directly here inside your products, collections, inventory, and all of that. Now guys, this is the part where you wanted to customize the product details. Now the tail of the important products to match your brand inside the Shopify dashboard. Let's go back here. What you wanted to do is to edit the product detail description and set competitive pricing. Let's hit here into products. Now, as you should see here, we have all our products and now we have our new product that we have imported from the dropshipper supplier. As you should see here is my title. Here's my product information. And here is my actual media. Everything is now been set up correctly and looks really great. And here is my actual price. So if you wanted to edit something, just do it inside here. Now what I wanted to do is just to make sure that this one actually comes directly inside the right collection, which in this case is my actual pillow gaze. And I wanted to make sure that my elements are already here inside my website. I'm going to hit into save. So as you should see here are my actual pillow cases. As you should see here is exactly the same product that we imported from Shane on here into our website. So there you have it guys. The actual process of importing products directly into our store is couldn't be much more easier guys. So guys, just in case you find this guide helpful, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more insight and hit that notification bell. Thank you for joining today guys. You have the link down below in the description to get started inside Shopify. Totally free and having a huge deal. Thank you once again guys. Hopefully we can all see you next time.